Hey, hey, friendos. We are going to take She-Hulk up against Taskmaster. This is practice for Solo Champions League 1201. Now, this is a protection rush deck that focuses on a bunch of activations. We have some extra draw from Tactical Scanner, so it's realistic to be able to do it, but it definitely doesn't work every time. Maybe one in three games we're able to get a turn one victory. Um, it's not there's a, some small backup plans in the game if you don't win in turn one, so this is not necessarily a deck I would advise to actually play your league rounds with, but it's just to show that you know this turn one victory is totally reasonable and, and not not a terrible victory. You still usually have three threat sticking around at the end. So let's get that initial hand. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. And this Adrenaline Rush is awesome. Um, right now we're just playing for the turn one victory, but we do have some allies to help us out in case we aren't able to get it, and then want to, you know, be able to get through the turn one villain and then actually win on turn two. So we got one activation and adrenaline rush here. Oh, amazing. Okay, so we got some extra activations and we are going to let's go so we flip taskmaster does one damage okay so the way the deck is built there are fighting fits so if i don't go below 15 i can use the fighting fits and there's what doesn't kill me if i take two or more damage i can use those all right so we Flipped, took our one damage, Taskmaster takes two damage. We're going to use Tactical Scanner to get five cards. One, two, three, four, five. So here, let's, let's count things up. We've got our two leading blows. Great. We've got two extra activations from Limitless Strength. Um... So we're going to want to be able to power those up. We've got two adrenaline rushes, which will help us make those leading blows even better. And then I guess we've got Starhawk to kind of clean things up. So let's see what happens here. We throw down... First Adrenaline Rush, which takes our attack from 3, 4, up to 5. We throw down a second Adrenaline Rush, which gets our attack up to 6. And then what we want to do is hopefully get these two leading blows to, to work, and then we can, once we flip, we can finish everything off. So, leading blow number one, we attack, we subtract zero damage from the leading blow. We've got a base attack of three, four, five, six, and we get the power stone. And we ready ourselves. Awesome. Now, um, now that we have the power stone uh, and our attack base attack is actually seven, so we got three, four, five, six, seven. What I think I would do is uh, attack straight up, ready with limitless strength. Then attack straight up, ready with limitless strength. Then do leading blow, and so that'll guarantee that we can get all the damage in that we need. We can also use Starhawk to um, get one. Well, we can't even take the main threat off. So we, we could exchange, I guess, two threat for, well, we can't even, we can take one threat off. whoop de doo Well, we'll do it anyway. Um, so I will just do a basic attack to defeat the villain. We get a counter card. I will use limitless strength to, to ready. We can now do a leading blow and we take one off that, so that's six damage. And then we ready. We do another attack for seven. We use limitless strength to ready. We bring out Starhawk for 
some extra health. Um, so we can either take one thread off or keep our health two points for health, three points for health, because we want 120%. So let's just keep Starhawk for health and then finish him off. And that is a turn one victory. We've got three threat. We've got 18 health. That's how it works.